dead hood. Looks like you've been eating well. Still big as an ox and twice as mean. <laughs> been a while, Harley. You good? Hmm. Was it too much to ask you to visit earlier? You were looking into something for Batman. What was it? Wait a second. This means the Bats is dead. For real. Well then. He asked me to profile some criminals. On account of my being a brilliant psychiatrist. Guess of all the criminals he knew, you'd be the one to ask. Hey! I am not a criminal! I'm misunderstood. Look, you know what I'm here for. Hand it over. Everything is in this book. But I'm missing my piece de resistance. I need you to follow up on this here card. That'll make it perfect. Figures you're not making this easy for me. It should be done in records. Okay. Bye. Seriously? Do I look like I'm 12 to you? supposed to do with this, Harley. Mm. Wow. Harley. 
Kelly's profiled some seriously antisocial prisoners here. Look, something's going on at Blackgate. We lean on that warden, we're set. No, these records go back centuries, man. The warden's new. Now she's involved. How did I miss this? Oh, right. Harley's stupid system makes no sense. Babs. Hey, Babs, what did you figure out? <laughs> they all got out on appeal. That's what Harley was tracking. In every case, key witnesses were murdered. Look, they were all pinned up with knives, just like Langstrom. Bruce is on to something. Oh? I think I've got something. Oswald Cobblepot, the Penguin. He's like everyone else in here, except he served his sentence every single time he was arrested. Someone must have hung him out to dry. Might be he's willing to talk. He runs the Iceberg Lounge now. Claims he went legit. <laughs> he definitely runs more than liquor through that bar. I wouldn't know. That man would never take me. If you wanted a fake ID, Tim, all you had to do was ask. Oswald's dangerous. And we can't forget Harley's still out there. We have to be careful. Relax, dick. We got this. Of course it's locked. That door's sandalwood. Custom job. Fixing it's gonna be a pain in the ass. Yeah, just answer my questions and I won't break anything else. Smile. Viral video of you assaulting Reform Citizen is the last thing you need right now. Reformed? Huh. Guess all that time in Blackgate did the trick. Funny how you weren't able to weasel out of it like so many of your pals. Hmm. Someone's done their homework. I want to know who's handing out get-out-of-jail cards. If you really want to go down this rabbit hole, you need to know there's no coming back from it. Never stopped me before. I'm gonna spell this out for you. With the back gone, you're not worth my time. Get lost. Beat it! Belfry, Penguin was a dead end. Whatever he knows, he's not telling. All right, come back to the Belfry and we'll regroup. Sounds good. Thanks. So you can use a door after all. You know why I'm here. They're listening. You may have questions. But I can think of a few reasons not to answer them. So you really are ready to play in the big leagues. I should drink to that. Bring over that bottle of whiskey. The 
rich and powerful have been getting a free pass out of Blackgate for years. But you served time. Why? They were favored. I wasn't. Favored by who? But no one talks about them. Not a whispered word is said. The Court of Owls is a myth. <laughs> Powers Club. Yep. Where the super rich go for shits and giggles. Might be worth a peek. Personally, I stay far away from that raptor's nest. <laughs> but you got no problem with me heading there. I lost years of my life to Blackgate. You go do what you do best. Just don't tell them I sent you. Belfry, you hear all that? Penguin sounded too eager to work together. Do you think he's up to something? Maybe, but from his reaction, he's convinced the Court of Owls is real. Okay, I'll do a deep dive on the court while you're out. Be in touch. Belfry, everything looks normal here. Time to look for that door. It will probably be well hidden. Remember the court rhyme. The Court of Owls is watching. From inside Gotham's walls. I know. Of course, it's creepy and glowing. I'm sure this is up to code. Scout cookies. I'm in, Belfry. It's some kind of court hideout. Doesn't look like anyone's here. Strange location for it. Any indication of what they were doing there? I'll look around and let you know. name from somewhere. Belfry, do you remember a murder case? Victim was someone named Moreno. Of course. The brother of Elena Moreno, a local judge. She took a leave of absence from the bench directly afterward for family reasons. It looks like the Court of Owls ordered the hit. Let me see what else I can find out. Belfry, I got it. The court ordered a hit at the Chelsea Tunnel. Construction on the tunnel was shut down when the site was declared unsafe. This reeks of a cover-up. The Court of Owls is hiding something down there. Going over now. Take care, and keep us updated. Belfry? Looks like the workers found a huge pit, then stopped. I'll probably be out of comms range down there. Track me if you can, and I'll check in when I get a signal. I'm heading down. Sure. Just don't make me come down there after you. Huge. What the hell? 
hell are they mining? to do science with me? I guess I'll just have to grab a sample for myself. Maybe I can figure out what they were after if I examine these samples. This stuff is called Dionysium. I guess we can run tests back at the Belfry. Now, how do I get back there? Get out of here. Alive. It's clear you don't understand your place. We earned our power. We sent Gotham into the great city she is today. We are the protectors, not you. You're just bats. And I'll devour bats.
blocked. Of course. Stupid cave-in. Belfry, can you read me? We seem to have you back, Red Hood. Are you all right? Everything's fine. The court's mining some weird shit called Dionysium. It sure reminds me of... Belfry, you cut out. Come in. Damn it. Lost the signal. You take forever to do the simplest of tasks. We have things to discuss. Come find me. The court of Owls is watching. From inside of Gotham's walls. They lurk in every shadow. And they rule you. One and all. You knew we'd find the court. You were just waiting for us to stick our necks out. When I was still part of the League, we observed the court's growth in Gotham. Now you can see the city's rotten core. They're mining something called Dionysium. And it smells like Lazarus pit water to me. A foul substitute for the true miracle. A contaminated extract. For centuries, the court has been looking for a fountain of youth. Instead, they found the makings of undying monsters. Hmm. So they're using Dionysium to make talons, then. What do you know? Huh. So why doesn't the League make a deal? Trade the court some green goo in exchange for mindless talon ninjas. <laughs> Even in their current debased state, the League would never descend to such banality. And the court's greed and corruption prevent them from ever mastering the secrets of the Lazarus Pits. <laughs> you turned a chemical reaction into some kind of Bullshit, holy ritual. Oh, those are some harsh words. That ceremony... ...resurrected you, Jason. I knew it was you, Talia. That pit scrambled my mind, but I'm still a damn good detective. I suppose gratitude was too much to expect in exchange for another stab at life. After all the shit you've done to me, I don't owe you anything. With Bruce gone, the court's operation grows. The League of Shadows will raise Gotham to the ground unless you silence the court. Cut the talking and riddles bullshit. You want us to get rid of the voice so the League will leave Gotham alone. What's in it for you, though, hmm? I'll do what I can to distract the League. And your path to the Court of Owls will be clear. Montoya feels. Hey, Alfred, did the city records turn up anything? They didn't. According to the city permits, there's been no mining in Gotham City since the cauldron was completed. Judging from what we found last night, they've been digging down there for centuries. Give this a listen, Alfred. Babs managed to repair some of the court voice recordings. Dionysium brought the Talons back to life. Sort of. Dionysium's basically weak as hell Lazarus pit water. Brings back motor functions. But free will's as good as gone. So what is a Talon exactly? Some kind of feral zombie assassin? We've all seen weirder shit. Maybe. Barrel zombie. Sounds like Jason, all right. <laughs> I recognize a voice. The older woman is Constance Cobblepot, I'm fairly certain. And the others? More difficult to say. Maybe if I heard them in person. In person? Tim, put the waveforms on the screen. It's hard to find a match with all the damage and voice modulation. 
Maybe the matching system would have better luck if- We match what we have against the live voices. Fun, but how do we find these jackasses? Two words, Orchard Hotel. The Masquerade. The event of the season. This year's dedicated to Master Bruce. Gotham's rich, dress up, and pretend they're humanitarians. I've been a few times. So it's Dirtbag Central. With so many of Gotham's elite together, security at the Masquerade will be tight. Finding out their plans first would give you an important advantage. I'll tweak our masks to record telescopic audio. If we can get a good vantage point, we may be able to put some faces to these mystery voices. Sounds like our kind of party. Hey, Belfry. I'm at the Orchard Hotel. The balcony door should be open. That's your entry point. A penthouse with a balcony? You spoil me, Belfry. Hands off the minibar. Our days of unlimited budgets are behind us. Belfry, I'm in. The court sure found themselves a swanky hangout. Remember to find a safe place to eavesdrop in the ballroom. If security sees you, you're toast. The party's already started in the ballroom. Good thing I remembered my mask. Stop battling. I don't want to hear you. Does my grandmother have the heart of one? <laughs> Belfry, I knocked out the cameras and the guards' comms. Good job. The guards outside the control room were planted there by the courts, so you can punch with impunity. Look carefully. Don't let them play mind games. That's how I get in. Belfry, I'm entering the ballroom. Nice work. Time to see how many of these rich snobs are court members. Record as much as possible. We need as much data as we can get. Did you sign the guest book? How could I not? I've got people to impress. Did you see some of the names in there? I did. Senators, judges, CEOs, even the mayor's here. <laughs> Look at this. Even in death, Wayne tries to outdo us. Let him have his final hurrah. After tonight, it won't be a problem. You're right. His death ought to be a celebration. What do you think this is? Got a few matches. Won't have to listen to these assholes for much longer. Hard to believe Bruce Wayne is gone. I know. I was hoping to be a state this year. Is this all they could muster for the great Bruce Wayne? It's embarrassing. When I go, it'll be a spectacle. Fireworks, dancers, ice sculptures, the works. Did you hear about Langstrom's assistant? He deserved to be... let go. Just like Kirk, people forget their place. The voice remembers. Yeah, those match. But where the hell is the voice? that formal wear was required this evening. This is formal wear. Have you been to the hotel's east staircase? The one they sealed off? Here, it's haunted. That's what I heard too. Strange noises, almost cries, and scratches in the walls. Ugh. What do you mean you won't see me? I'm the goddamn mayor! I'm afraid his schedule won't permit it. You tell Colonel Kane that I won't be frozen out. My office demands respect. Of course it does, Mayor Sai. I'll relay your message. This is 
good. Great evening. Who would have thought this would give the rest of us such a kick in the pants? Sorry to interrupt, but it's time. Ah, of course. We'll have to continue this later. Found one. It is my absolute pleasure to present our host for the evening. Seriously? If that's the voice, he's not even trying to hide it. Thank you all for the warm welcome. But tonight is not about me. We are here to remember one of Gotham's greatest sons, Bruce Wayne. Now, you all knew the Playboy. I knew his charity. A brash defender of Gotham's best. Though he's gone now, Bruce's contributions to this city will be felt for decades to come. This is for you, Bruce. The last of our precious Wayne family. You've helped us in ways you never realized. And may we, the surviving families of Gotham, strive to live up to your inimitable legacy. for the voice of the court. Stay close to him. We still need to figure out who he is. Sir, the labs are requesting more Dionysium to meet their production deadline. I'm aware. Arrangements are being made. Let them know that I expect the quota to be met. No excuses. Thank you, sir. Pleases the court. Excellent. I'll see you downstairs. got in a secret elevator, then dropped off the radar. Same here. I lost track of him between floors. Red Hood, we just found a hidden 13th floor in the hotel blueprints. Maybe that's where the voice went. Not gonna happen. I don't even know how to play this thing. Belfry, I'm on the 13th, and I found one of those Court of Owls doors. Understood. Tread carefully. The court 
of owls is watching from inside of Gotham's walls. This is a literal truth as we build our perfect nests below the skins of our perfect city. And now, from vinyl right to your eardrums, it's the old voice of the court. So now the voice wants to play hide and seek. Great. Belfry, got any tips to find the voice? Belfry, you there? Damn it, cut off again. They say an owl can turn its head all the way around to better see what is behind it, what might be trying to sneak up and strike. certainly cannot be underestimated. It is a predator after all. And so are we. Langstrom. This recording could be just what we need to bring them down for good. But there's still plenty to clean. Destroy everything. Make it so Langstrom never existed. We must send a message. You are only an owl of the court. So long as you remain loyal to the court. That's a lot of names. Hold on. All these people are either missing or dead. Kirk Langstrom is on here. Is this a hit list? Utopia, 
And we alone made it. Are you gonna show yourself, or what? Go to the painting. So you made it here, all by yourself. Well, someone had to stop you from destroying Gotham. Destroy Gotham? Now we're trying to save her. Preserve her glory. I understand now the potential you could have to do the same. Oh. Power and glory. Hmm. Never had that offer from a weirdo in a mask. The only one hiding there in a mask... ...is you, Mr. Todd. Jacob Kane? How... How do you know? I know. Just like I knew my nephew Bruce was out there, keeping the peace in his armored pajamas. <laughs> Don't worry, I didn't tell anyone. Call it... loyalty to Martha. We all live double lives, trying to shelter the city from chaos. It's just... our court is quieter about it. The people of Gotham will find out you've been playing with their lives. They're not your toys. Yeah, Batman would probably say the same thing in your position. That's why I never told Bruce about the court. We have the same ends, the same enemies. It's madness. You're not serving us. I stopped killing people. <laughs> A difference in tactics, I'll admit. You say you protect Gotham, but you're racking up a body count. Kirk Langstrom, his assistant... Those who betray us will suffer for it. Langstrom betrayed the court. Bruce gave everything to save this city. You fight for yourselves. He would never have supported this. Do not use my nephew against me. I mourn Bruce. I want answers for his death, just like you. I am nothing like you, Jacob. Understood. I protected Bruce, but I won't protect you. If you won't join us, I'm afraid you'll have to join Langston. Clearly, I have bigger problems right now. Just stay out of my way. You won't like what happens next. Gotta get back to the ballroom ASAP. Red Hood! No, no, please, don't! Oh, yeah. uh. God damn it! These people don't stand a chance against the League! Time to take care of these jerks. The GCPD is about to enter the hotel. I'd suggest a quick exit.
the slaughter of some of our best and brightest at the Orchard Hotel is a new low for the city of Gotham. It is time for the real heroes, the GCPD, to step up and restore order in our city. To take it back. Yeesh. Surprisingly, Commissioner Kane isn't a match for any of the voices we collected. Hey! She may not be a court member, but the Commissioner could still be helping them. She did marry Jacob. Catherine is probably not aware of her husband's secret. I know Jacob well, and have never had even the slightest suspicion. Colonel Asshole fooled everyone. Even Bruce. The other people we matched at the ball. John Wycliffe, Isabella Haas, Maria Powers. All killed at the hotel by the league. Colonel Kane's the only member we know survived for sure. And probably old lady Cobblepot. She's unaccounted for. And the court is clearly much bigger than Jacob Kane and Constance Cobblepot. The almighty voice was right, you know. No one will believe a nursery rhyme's been pulling Gotham's strings for so long. But people will believe that Jacob Kane conspired to murder Langstrom. We have the evidence to prove it. Let's get this to Detective Montoya. See if it's enough for her to build her case. I'll be sure to include our list of known members, dead or otherwise. We need to be careful about this. Jacob will be waiting for us to try something. Someone should talk to Talia. The court and the League are clearly out to kill each other. And let's be ready when we're caught in between them. Could have told us your league was planning a murder spree at the charity ball. Does this look like my league? Did they decapitate the court? Did you? No. Despite all the killings, the voice is still alive. Then the league will keep attacking, regardless of collateral damage. And the court will send their talons to retaliate. How many of Gotham's citizens will die in the crossfire, Talia? Countless. The league will decimate the city. And the court is preparing something even more impressive. And that is? Langstrom wrote that living subjects could create more powerful talents. I don't want to be around when they get out. What else do you know about what Langstrom was doing? As much as I've liked our chats, Gotham is getting decidedly unfriendly. Don't come looking for me. Court mask. I knew it. Belfry, tell Montoya she was right. The cops were covering up stuff for the court. Affirmative. Montoya says she has it covered from here. You've received an urgent message from Penguin. Please return as soon as possible. Sounds good. See you soon. We have new clues for the board. I helped you. Now you gotta help me. My family found out about our little chat. They're up for blood. Please, you gotta get over here before they... Shit. They've got Penguin pinned down at the Iceberg Lounge. So, the League finally sent their assassins after the court. Talia warned us this would happen. But I didn't think it'd be so public. The League usually prefers to avoid the spotlight, but this time they wanted to send a message. They're coming for the court, and they won't stop until they've wiped out all corruption from Gotham.
Shit list now. What the hell is this place anyway? What's that smell? Belfry, do you read? Belfry! Great. I'm cut off. Oh, that's just great. Huh. Nice trick. You do this for all your guests? The hell is wrong with this thing? Face it. You can't save anyone. And Damn it! I tried to teach you what I knew, but you were hopeless. Oh God! Not a Lazarus pit! Not again! Best day.
Air is way better here. They must have gassed the whole damn place. Please let that be a way out. He looks important. I bet he'd love to tell me all about his project. <laughs> Talk, and I won't start breaking things. What is this place? <laughs> we grabbed the volunteers here for Project Goliath. It's talent deployment. Volunteers? The dead can't consent to your experiments. They're not dead at first. The new ones, they offer themselves up for the cause. Thanks. I'm going to knock you out now. God, you're making a whole Talon army. They could take over the entire city with this. Shit! I made it out. Red Hood, are you there? Your signal just reappeared on the bat computer. Do you read me? I read you, Belfry. It's good to hear your voice. Thank God. Are you okay? Yeah. I'm in one piece. Come back to the Belfry as soon as you can. Talons, the labyrinth, all punishment for exposing the court. To think Jacob Kane ever thought we could be on the same side. The labyrinth wasn't just meant to kill us. The court wanted to get in our heads. It might have worked. We'll be okay, Tim. Will we? Batman didn't kill people, but where would he stand on soldiers lining up to be reborn as these monsters? I used to be dead. You think I'm a monster? We have one setback. 
And this is where you go, Tim? Murder? I get steering him away from killing people, but the labyrinth was more than a setback, Babs. Don't talk about me like I'm not here. You're not Bruce. None of you are. Enough! Gotham practically lined up to kill Batman. Every time Bruce came home, bloodied, near death, I patched him up. Just as I now do for you. He was often angry, but he never stooped to their level. And neither will you. Alfred's right. Batman had a code. No matter how tough this gets, we can't betray it. The court is made up of Gotham's founding families. They'll protect their own like only family will. They may be related, but they aren't family. Not like we are. The evidence we uncovered against Kane at the hotel is pretty much bulletproof. Then our best course of action isn't war, it's prosecution. I don't think Kane's gonna honor a warrant. He will if we help the cops serve it. The same cops currently gunning for every cape in Gotham? I can think of at least one still on our side. Judge, you gonna tell me where she is? Look, we're not crazy enough to cross the people who want Moreno dead. But the regulators, they've been bragging about a big protection job. Thanks for the tip. Oh. Hey, Belfry, looks like the mob's got nothing to do with Moreno. But they mentioned something interesting with the regulators. Affirmative. Let us know if you learn anything new. <clears throat> You're going to tell me where I can find Judge Moreno, right? I don't know! But I know we just sold some top-end security equipment. Maybe it was for her! Good enough for me. Mm. Belfry, the regulators said they sold the Freaks some security tech, but that's it. The Freaks wouldn't do that unless they had a reason. I wonder if it's related to Moreno. This real symbol. What can you tell me about Elena Moreno? You know, the judge. Oh yeah, I heard that all we gotta do is keep her Gosh, safe from the, the freaks, did the you? masks. Easy. Thanks a lot. Jackass. <laughs> yeah. Belfry, Moreno was paying the freaks for protection. I'm headed to her location. Good to know. Be careful out there. Are you okay? They were gonna kill me. Just like they killed my brother. Poor Alex. All this because I wouldn't close construction on the Chelsea Tunnel? The court doesn't like it when people say no to them. Damn it. They are real. You can help take them down. I've got a warrant for the arrest of their leader. I'll sign it. People like that can't be allowed to terrorize this city. Glad we're on the same page then. Want me to call someone to pick you up? Someone's already on their way. I knew the freaks couldn't keep this up, so I called a friend. Thank you. And good luck, Red Hood. Belfry, Moreno's fine. I got her to sign the arrest warrant, too. Good to know. 
We'll make sure she stays safe. Is the blindfold really necessary? Not anymore. you can make it. Welcome to the Belfry. You're back, girl. Did your father know? If he did, he never said. But now you know. If you're gonna help us take down Jacob Kane, we need to trust each other. Dick Grayson. Well, I guess you're Nightwing, then. Is it that obvious? It's pretty obvious. You don't even, like, do a voice or anything. Robin. I don't think we've met out of costume. Actually, we've met. Like, five times. Oh, yeah. Tim Drake, right? We done laying our cards on the table? We got a plan to go over. Jason Todd. The dead walk among us. I get that a lot. You get what we needed? The judge actually signed off on the Jacob Kane charge. Conspiracy to murder Langstrom. Some solid detective work. If you could get Kane out of that hidey hole, I can make sure every honest cop in Gotham is waiting out front. Huh. But that won't be easy. This building is basically a tank. Oh, we know. Armored facade. Anti-aircraft guns on the roof. That's why we have drones. I assume you don't have a permit for that. We absolutely do not. Gotta admit, Pennyworth, I was kind of hoping you were Batman and just retired or something. Hmm. While I'm flattered, the truth is unfortunately more grim. I'm sorry to hear that. So, about that plan. The plan? Yes. You're gonna love it. To start, you'll rendezvous at the rally point in sight of the target, Kane Industries. We have new clues for the board. A spate of large animal sightings and violent attacks across Gotham has authorities scrambling. Gotham is no stranger to creatures causing havoc in the streets, but this most recent activity appears especially coordinated and widespread. The carnage has all but overwhelmed city hospitals. It's like an army of bears has moved into the city, said one ER doctor. This is Nur Rashid with GCN. It's go time. Everyone ready? Drones on standby. Street level. Every floor of Kane Industries is protected by proprietary armor. You'll need to scale the building. Great. Time for a workout. Reports of increased League of Shadows activity are pouring in from all over the city. Let's hope Talia's right if they leave town when we stop the court. Top 
military contractors. These won't be your standard guards. Don't let Red Hood get a lead on it! I guess when you're Jacob Kane, anti-aircraft guns are standard equipment. Our intel shows that Kane uses proprietary armor to protect what needs protecting in there. Only his own tech will cut through it. You'll need a laser cutter. Kane keeps one in the munitions storage area. This looks experimental and heavy duty. Could probably cut straight through a wheel clamp. I am a laser drill, serial number KD-847 prototype. Shit, it talks. Warning, this prototype is single use only. Guess we'll have to make it count. Now that you've found the laser, you'll need a way to move around the floor. Get an access card, then we can rewrite it with your biometric signature. Watch out, you got... There we go. We can't rewrite the key card with your biometrics unless you bring it to the security station. Pelfrey, the card doesn't work. Were you even listening? Something about how it won't work unless you rewrite the biometric data at the security station. Okay, good. Okay, now I can access everything on this floor. Kane's office. Judging from the blueprints, that's where you'll find his private elevator to the bunker. Belfry, this office is a different shape from what's on the blueprints. Something's not right. Damn it. How does this work again? Each block must contain a symbol, remember? I knew there was a secret office. A lot of trouble to hide this room. I'm pretty sure that even fancy globes don't have to be wired to paintings. Huh. It's like he thinks he's the villain in a spy movie. That's some tough armor. Only Kane's tech can cut through it. Okay, talking laser. Show me what you can do. I am a laser drill, serial number KD-847 prototype. Yeah, I got that part, but how do I make you cut? Cutting. Holy shit, that's loud. Do you have a silent mode? Negative. Stop! On the ground! Clean all the way to that elevator. Once you're in there, get moving. This is as far as our plan goes, so get ready to improvise. Do you have any idea what's waiting down there? The only thing we know for sure is that the elevator goes to a bunker under the building. Right. Thanks for the tactical insight. Be ready for anything. Stop them before they get to Colonel.
Colonel Kane. She's down! Huh. Time to head down. Belfry, my key card's not working anymore, and I've got an inclinator to move. Can one of you remote hack it? Okay, I've tweaked the code to allow you access. Perfect. Thanks. Attention all security personnel. Intruders have breached the facility lower levels. Weapons hot. They're vigilantes. Yeah, mostly. Kane must be getting desperate if he's sending out the talents. Be careful. Who knows what he'll throw at you next? This room must be some kind of power control center. And it looks like there's enough to light up the city. Can you cut the power from there? No. Then I'd be stuck down here. I'd better find a way through instead. Belching fire and toxic gas. It's about the second worst thing I've ever smelled. There's no way I can get through there. Unless. Hey, is anyone still able to hack in? Ready and waiting. What's up? Please tell me there's something labeled reactor. Mm. Found it. Reactor diagnostics mode. That sounds good. Choose that one. Belfry, I found a place that looks like a Court of Owls HQ. I'm gonna check it out. Belfry, can you hear me? I guess it's just me now. All this trouble! This is Gotham's legacy! Can't they see that? Belfry, are you there? You're on your own now. Down here, nothing gets in or out unless I say so. So, is part of your plan that I get this far? It's that same armor plating from before. I miss my talking laser. So this fires the laser. Oh, Kane is gonna hate this. Firing weapon system. Stop right there! They never listen. Your purpose to serve a calling higher than yourself to protect 
your city to maintain order. Gotham is a sanctuary where the worthy corpses arrive. This facility was built to withstand a full military incursion. You're doing what Bruce did. Fumbling in the dark, thinking you know what's best for Gotham, but you're fighting the wrong battle. The League of Shadows are fanatics who will slaughter half the city to purify it. So you're building a goddamn army to fight the League? To save Gotham from itself. Gotham needs hunters, our new knights. They thrive in the shadows like Bruce did. Like you do. But unlike you, they know their place. I'm coming for you next, Kane. Gotham won't accept the court is real, let alone believe I'm the voice. So what? They just have to believe you killed Langstrom. Uh, and what if I did? Huh? Where's the reporter who'll cover it? Or the cop who'll arrest me? Much less the judge who'll convict me. It's the judge's day off, but the rest are waiting outside for you. My wife is still commissioner. I'll be free before sunup. Montoya. Jacob Kane. Barely a scratch on him. <laughs> <laughs> Working with vigilantes, detective? Catherine will have your badge for this. Hell of a trade if it puts you away.
Tell them I'm innocent. Don't give me that shit, Jacob. Don't you say another word. I can... Jacob! Jacob! Stupid, stupid man. We need to get these people out of here. Find who did this. Search everywhere. Search the rooftops. Go! just shot Jacob. He's dead. She took off, but I'm on her tail. Stay on her. Looks like Talia's heading for Wayne Tower. What the hell, Talia? Jacob Kane was coming along peacefully, and you murdered him! No, we murdered him. The League of Shadows thanks you for your collaboration. Bruce was never this helpful. <laughs> you lied to my face about not being in charge. How long have you been planning your takeover? Years? Decades. I have a clarity of vision that my father lacked. Without him, the League can reach its full potential. I'm surprised you didn't kill the old man yourself. I didn't need to. So now what? Hmm? I don't suppose you and your League will leave quietly. The Orchard Hotel was just the beginning. Our work in Gotham will serve as a beacon, a warning of what is to come. In a torrent of blood, we will purge corruption from this city, then the world. Your father used to make speeches like that. They didn't impress me either. Then I won't waste your time. I've only let you live this long because you were useful. I did remake you, after all. I remain myself. And I'm gonna take you down. For Bruce, and for me. Even Bruce would tell you. Nothing can stop the reckoning that's in motion. Farewell. Damn it. Jacob in custody. We were finally gonna bring him in. And now, she's got everything she needs to start the next phase of her plan. She'll go after our allies first, to keep us out of the way. Exactly. That's why I already sent them a warning. Lucius is holing up in a secure location with a small security team. And Montoya is scrambling people she trusts. It won't be enough. They'll die without our help. League attacks. All over the city. It's already started. to the League to pick a place creepier than Arkham. Steady. Even I wouldn't survive that jump. So how do I get across?
wonderful. It is a Lazarus pit. I saw what you left at Arkham. Sick, even for you. Did you know, child? A Lazarus pit can be used for more than just saving people from the brink of death. It has many purposes. In fact, a Lazarus pit can make a mind more malleable, more pliable to suggestion. Oh, do tell me more about the wonders of the Lazarus pits. Sometimes it's about more than your army. Sometimes it's about having the right general leading it. What? I wasn't good enough for you? That hurts. <laughs> you, like your precious Batman, were never able to save Gotham. I've finally solved that problem. By repeated exposures to the Lazarus Pit. Unlike my father, I used that exposure to free Bruce's mind from his ridiculous oath. And you, you're right where we need you. Bruce's last test. Then we lead our new league into glory, remaking the world. Defeat this pretender. Take back the city that is your birthright. Just once! Street cred if anyone sees me helping you. <laughs> you don't have to prove yourself to anybody. 
least of all me. Let's go. I can deal with Talia later. <clears throat> What the hell, Bruce? All you had to do was stand still, beloved. Let me dispose of this burden for both our sakes. No! <coughs> Please, Bruce. You can't. It's your turn, Jason. I know you won't give up. I should have left you in your grave. For his sake, Talia, I'm not gonna kill you. But this is gonna hurt you a lot more than it will me. joke. You, my dear Jason, so focused on hunting me down, you missed your own determined pursuer. Oh no, the fault is with you, Talia Al Ghul. Your abomination led us here, and now you and it will die. <laughs> you will never bring death to an Al Ghul. Crew without me. Become your own heroes. The knights that Gotham really needed. <coughs> Together you're.
stronger than the Batman ever could be. I'm so proud of all of you. And I'm sorry. What are you doing? You might want to run. Lazarus pit is gone. Blasted to bits. With the pit destroyed, the Court of Owls has gone to ground. Mostly. It's only a matter of time till they show up again. Talia got the hell out of Dodge. Laying low somewhere to plan her next move. Of course, she left a few of her League puppets behind to keep an eye on us. Or keep us busy. Both, probably. We checked the Batwing. Or what's left of it. He's dead. Gotham needs me. The court will try to cover this up, like they do everything else. But they're not the only ones watching. Exposing Jacob Kane was just the beginning. this 
I'm Batman. Really, Dick? <laughs> Alfred had dinner ready an hour ago. How many versions of this are you gonna make? Let me check. In the event of my death at the hands of Crazy Quilt? Seriously? What about the event of my death? Of starvation? Hear that? You're neglecting this poor kid. You promised we'd have dinner together as a family. You guys start, I'll be right up. Oops. My hand slipped. But now you're up, so let's go. This is important. Would you just go? Or is I forgot to eat and starve to death on your list of videos? I mean, if you want some advice on being dead, I got you covered. Oh, this is gonna be good. You're gonna need my password. Am not. You got a second chance to say goodbye. That's more than you get with most people. But it's not fair! What Talia did. How are you not angry about that? Oh, I'm furious at Talia. For everything. And someday, I'll make sure she's held accountable for what she's done. But Bruce wouldn't want me to be angry right now. He'd... want me to carry on. Like he'd want all of us to. <laughs> 